Hey everybody, she's a brisk day in the neck of the woods today. It was minus 40 at the truck when I left. And oh, minus 32 here at the tent. I just got here, I'm gonna have a tea, warm up the hands, I lit a fire, and I'm gonna go in where it's warm. Um, I had a fresh skiff of snow since uh, I was out here on Monday. And um, the lakes have been moving. I got a few. I'm all for six for traps coming in here today. And I had uh, a few misses. One, two, three, four to be exact. Four misses. So maybe I'll show them on the way out. You can see where the cats Walked right up, I had a uh, trail set, they knocked the snares down, um, walked right through it, and then uh, a couple of cubbies that they've they've uh, gotten around as well. So maybe I'll show you that. Hopefully I get some fur down the line. Talk to you in a bit. Okay, hey everybody. She's been a quiet day on the trap line. It's warmed up to about minus 28. Uh, this is the last trap that's unchecked and uh, I copied Richard Mellon from uh, Trapping Inc on this one he uh, he just hung a 330 on a well I guess it must have been an old spruce so he hung it on and uh, put some lynx fur on it and so I'd been trapping this beaver dam or uh, beaver lodge and uh, trying to get beavers and every time I came here there was fresh lynx tracks and so I thought I'm gonna set one of those up and uh, so I'm just coming up and the, the pole is down and covered under the snow is what looks to be a beautiful lynx. Right on. And you can see I had it where those, uh, those two poles are. So he, he came a little ways. I'll pull him out and have a look at him. Okay, I'm just going to have a look at this lynx that I caught here. be careful it was really warm last time I was out here on Monday and uh, it was plus four and there was no lynx then but uh, came back here today she's minus she was in the minus 30s all day today I'm gonna take some time pull it out nicely and then we'll have a okay got uh, dug it out of the snow Kind of frozen in there, I wanted to be careful. But uh, as you can see, this cat wouldn't have felt much. He uh, couldn't hesitate this little tuft of uh, lynx fur that I had there. Um, yeah, stuck his head in there and paid the ultimate price. So I'll take this home and thaw it out before I try to get the trap off and then I'll reset it next time I'm out. Right on, that's the only fur for the day, but that's uh, cat, that's lynx number uh, 17 for me this year. Right on guys.